guys, it's May here. Welcome to my channel and welcome to Cooking 101 everyone. For today's dish, we're going to make some soup out of this native chicken over here. I got this chicken um, the other day at TNT Supermarket. This will be a good soup for today. It's my dad's 40th day's death anniversary, so this is one of his favorite soup. And I'm going to um, cook this one with papaya. So let me show you my ingredients for our soup for today. Friends, I have a very plain and simple ingredients for this soup. Over here, I have papaya. I, um, I used one whole papaya for this. We have our beautiful spinach here. Ginger bell peppers lemongrass guys don't forget to pound the tip of the lemongrass okay because that's how you extract the beautiful flavor of lemongrass over here i have some scallions this is these are the tip of the scallions i'm going to use this one for starting my soup and over here this is the top one i'm going to use some Korean peppers to season our soup. We have fish sauce. If you guys don't want to use fish sauce, you can use regular salt, okay? But for me, I like using fish sauce. We also have some black pepper corn, and we're going to use some chicken broth mix. This is by Noor. So guys, I'm gonna show you very plain and simple soup that anyone can make this especially the teenagers who follow my channel so let's start over here i have my two pots of water one is uh, for um just boiling the meat first before i turn um, the meat into a soup i don't really like making soup with blood on it so that's how i usually do it so if you guys want to do the same thing you will have a better taste of your soup <laughs> so anyhow this one is for making my soup so i'm running the two of them at the same time so this will save me time so okay guys let's start our cooking 101 okay friends now that our water is ready lemongrass and the tip of the scallions ginger we're going to let this one simmer for 15 minutes before we add the rest of our ingredients over here on my other pot the water is also ready so we're going to um, boil our chicken for like 10 to 15 minutes and this is how our chicken looks like so let's put it here Hello everyone. Hi. <laughs> Sorry guys. Okay. So now all we have to do is wait. We're going to boil this one for uh, 10 to 15 minutes and then we'll turn them into a soup. Friends, this is our chicken now. After 20 minutes, I will rinse it with um, lukewarm water and as you guys can see, they are nice and clean, right? Especially guys when you clean the chicken make sure you clean the inside okay this is the backbone make sure that it's it's clean there's nothing there's no dried blood or whatever stuck in the cavity of the bones so okay now we're going to turn them into a soup so I added a little bit of water and look guys my water is turning kind of like the gingery color so we're going to put all our chicken there It's hot. Huh. 
Hello again, everyone. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just happy today. All right, so that's it. We're going to let this one simmer for 45 minutes, but before that, let's add some of our ingredients. Okay, let's add some black pepper corn. A little bit more. And then two tablespoons of the chicken broth mix. One. Next, three tablespoons of the fish sauce. Okay, that's it. And we're going to give this one a good mix. Okay, we're going to let this one simmer for half an hour to 45 minutes. Okay. Let's cover them. And then we wait. And after an hour, let's check our chicken. I decided to boil this one for an hour. Oh, guys, look at that. And the smell of the ginger and the lemongrass. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add our bell peppers. Add our bell peppers here. And then we're also going to add the papaya. Okay, now the papaya. So after we put the papaya, we're going to let this one simmer for another 15 minutes. Okay. And then we're going to add the Korean peppers and we're going to cover them back and we wait friends after 20 minutes let's check our soup Ooh, look at that guys it's beautiful and it smells good the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add the rest of the scallions this is the last one that we're going to do and then the spinach, we can do it after. Actually, guys, the spinach, you can always salad it. Like, make, uh, like you know, make them into a salad. So, we don't really need to kind of like really cook it. So, we're just going to wait for another five minutes. And then we're going to add our spinach. Okay, friends, the last thing we're going to do is we're going to add some spinach on our soup. There you go. The goodness of the spinach. I turned the stove off already because I don't want my spinach to be overcooked. So, there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is our soup for today, you guys. Very plain and simple, but yet it's very healthy soup. Okay, so I'll show you guys the finished product. Friends, this is our finished product. This is our native chicken with papaya. And um, guys, you should try this kind of soup. It's really, really good. If you guys like this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And also, if you haven't subscribed on my channel yet, you guys, please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Have a blessed day, everyone, wherever you are in the world. And may the good Lord bless us all. Thank you guys again for watching. And guys, please stay safe.